Welcome to Real Food and in this video I'm going to unpack my Tesco shopping bags. Um, we are still in a very serious lockdown in London. It's tier 4, it's one of the highest, but luckily the shops are still open and there are some really lovely things in, um, in shops and the shops aren't even crowded. I was very pleased today that my local Tesco was well stocked, um, no empty shelves, and some really amazing bargains. So, let's begin. Um, what I found today was this really delicious um, pineapple from Costa Rica. It looks very healthy, very good. I'm sure I'll make very good use of it. It's perfect um, fresh. You know, I'll just cut it, remove the, the spiky and hard bits and use it um, as a healthy snack. Also, um, something interesting about pineapple. Pineapple contains an important enzyme called bromelain or something like this. And this enzyme is um, very helpful in digesting a variety of foods. So pineapple, if you are having difficulty digesting um, with your digestive system, um, a little bit of pineapple can be really useful. So do read up a little more about um, these enzymes that pineapples contain and see if this will be helpful for you. I also found this um, beautiful English classic, um, Aged Blue Stilton. I recently discovered that I have problems with lactose, um, but I also found at the same time um, that um, cheeses, because they're already fermented products, they're fermented foods, they contain um, much less lactose or very little. So I'm not allergic to lactose, so it's not going to cause huge problem, um, but um, products that contain a lot of it, they can cause um, problems for my digestive system. So I've picked this beautiful Tesco Finest Aged Blue Stilton. I'm sure it will be very useful. So um, then I also have on the healthy side, I've got um, these gorgeous bananas, and I think they are organic, yes. Yes, these are organic bananas. They're always very helpful because they contain very good dose of potassium, very good for your heart um, functioning. And um, what I like um, about this Tesco that I, I use is that this it's a, it's a very small Tesco, I have to say, but it's well stocked. So the truck is always, always truck there unloading um, new fresh supplies because there's such high turnover of products in this store. Everything is always fresh and especially bananas. So you can see these, these are green. And this is how I like them because when they're very ripe, turning very yellow and um, black, um, there's too much sugar in them already. So these will be um, resistant starches that are contained in these. So they, um, they're very good for your insulin production and basically an anti-diabetes um, type of starch when it's resistant in this kind of um, green state. So, um, the next item I will show is this lovely um, pack of bagels. And what I like about these Warb Warburton's bagels is that um, they're, they're quite thin. So if you eat one, you, you don't feel like you've eaten a lot of bread. Um, so it kind of um, reduces the amount of bread um, by design that you eat. But nevertheless, they're useful as a snack. And if you want to dip um, a piece of bread in olive oil, so these I find very useful. Another thing um, that I'm glad my Tesco is... is um, as you, is stocking is this pastry so um, I am a little lazy I should have made my own pastry but uh, this is really useful so you can actually make your own snacks and, um, and delicious foods using this pastry so this will be just roll they also have a selection of different types like uh, phyllo and they've got short crust um, they've got all sorts of pastries so these these will be very useful no doubt My next item is um, asparagus, and I'm really glad. And there was a lot of fresh um, salads and vegetables. Um, there was a lot of information in the news to say that um, Britain is about to run out of fresh <laughs> fruit and vegetables um, because of Brexit and because there were these problems on the border in Kent. Um, France temporarily closed their border, so there was an accumulation of lorries. Um, so transportation was disrupted and some supermarkets um, indicated that they might run out of fresh vegetables and fruits. Well, nevertheless, my, my Tesco was absolutely fine today and um, I found these gorgeous 
asparaguses, and these are this, these are coming from Peru. So I guess these were transported by air, not not through France. So there will be no shortage of asparagus at, at the very least. All right. Um, I also found this amazing um, organic again unsalted butter. You know what? I'm really I'm really impressed. I have to say I'm really impressed how uh, my tiny tiny Tesco Express has so many really good products. I mean, organic butter, um, organic bananas, they've got fresh asparaguses. I mean, it's really impressive, and they're doing a really good job, I think. And this organic butter, again, is going to be very useful for for snacks, for frying, for cooking, etc. Then another healthy thing I found in my Tesco was this corn, our fresh, fresh corns, which are very easy to prepare. They're a fantastic snack. Um, you can just um, simmer, um, steam or boil them gently for a few minutes and they're ready to eat. They are absolutely gorgeous. So really, really pleased and very impressed again with my local Tesco. So um, now more useful things from Tesco. Um, I did mention um, recently that I, I found that I'm lactose intolerant. Um, so, but I used to enjoy yogurts, and now yogurts I found um, still contain too much lactose. So I've switched um, to um, Alpro, and Alpro offers a really nice alternative. It it has a variety of um, uh, substitutes instead of cow's milk. They've got um, um, soy, they've got um, coconut, they've got all sorts of um, plant-based varieties. And this particular one is a soy-based um, plain yogurt, um, which is going to be fantastic. Um, I'm glad, again, that my tiny Tesco stores all these wonderful uh, foods. So now we're going um, to drinks, and um, I wanted to show um, this one, this particular one, Purdy's. I have been drinking them for a while, and again, ever so impressed, a tiny Tesco has these specialty drinks. Um, so this is a, a carbonated juice drink, but it's not just sugar and carbon carbonated drink. It has a huge array of vitamins, and this is really good. So this one has vitamin C, B1, B2, B3, B6, B12, um, and might have some other additional things. Um, so and this is made uh, with blend of blackberry and um, and slowberry juices, which is which is sounding amazing. Um, this company makes this black variety and their original one silver bottle. So I, I decided to try this black one because I typically go for silver, but I guess this black one will be just as fine. So another another thing, another drink I bought uh, was this Curiosity Cola. Cola. I don't like um, the traditional uh, American Coca-Cola co cola, but this drink is again based on botanical extracts, on real, not chemicals. Um, it still has sugar, and it is a carbonated drink, um, but I prefer this to the Coca-Cola, you know, drink. If I want some of, of the cola, I would rather go for this than Coca-Cola, and I'm so pleased, again, my tiny Tesco stores, these, um, I would even say these are, these are now alternative drinks, and they still have space for all this. Um, so, and now, to the most impressive um drink I found in my local tiny Tesco is this gorgeous bottle of Prosecco. So this is this is very kind of them. And again, um, they're not very expensive, but it's a really good traditional Italian champagne style drink, a bubbly wine. So um, this is a very heavy bottle. So my trip to Tesco, I have to tell you, was um, unintentionally both a trip um, to do some shopping and um, a gym style like workout because these heavy bottles I had to carry <laughs> was like a, a gym, like a short gym workout. So I'm really pleased. So I think I've covered pretty much everything um, I I found in my local Tesco this time. Um, I hope this was useful and let me wish you bon appetit and a fantastic evening. Um, or if you're watching during the day, a fantastic day. And we'll chat again soon.